Oh my goodness. So, what's up, y'all? So, 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 Luminati cut his hair or is cutting his hair in this video. So, I'm not even gonna talk that much. Um, this one is Cut My Hair Ball. So, without further ado, y'all, let's just hop straight into this video. Dewey so in the building. Hoodie so in the building. <laughs> guys, guys, in the building. Was good with toy chunk. <laughs> These intros be killing me. <laughs> Boys. I just cut my hair bald, man. Oh, he already did it. I thought we was gonna get to see him do it. I cried too. I ain't gonna lie. And I should have never cut my mustache. I got it. I ain't ate pussy in like four years, but my and I'm gonna grow my beard out too. Becoming my best self, man. It's like, let me tell y'all this. After 10 years, I just cut my dress. Feel like I released a lot of anxiety or something, like pain and baggage. And like, bro, I got cars, clothes, I got everything I fucking want. Girls see my hair, they don't care. They gonna let you fuck regardless. Out of everything I want, millions fucking? of fans, millions of subscribers, I was still high and shit, bro. And we in a world, like, they want us to be so fucking perfect, bro. Ain't nobody perfect, my nigga. Everybody trying to get their bodies done. Everybody don't want to accept. They don't want to accept themselves. It's like they programming us to hate ourselves because everybody want to be perfect. So it's making the motherfuckers that see them on a regular basis. Like, if you're on social media 24-7, you're seeing people that's living perfect lives. Ain't nobody lives really that perfect behind closed doors, bro. It's like... Me in the Matrix. They fucking with y'all stocks. Me in the Matrix. I just cut Me my through this high-pitched voice. Kobe. Look how small my head is. Rest in peace to Kobe. I got the Kobe, and I want you to know, it's no such thing as being ugly. As long as you love yourself, accept yourself. Be free. I feel free as fuck. Good for you. I feel free. Accept yourself. Love yourself. People gonna treat you how you treat yourself. I'm about to be a fucking meme. I already know. But <laughs> let me show y'all this. Wow. When I first, listen, when I first did it, I cried. But after a while, I felt a sense of relief. Like I released a lot of like pain, like. I feel good as hell right now. I'm actually smiling. I'm happy as fuck. Let me show y'all this though. All right. <laughs> I just went all over my shit. Just let it all go, man. <laughs> you gotta let go to grow. Oh my God, that looked like it hurt. Excuse my elbows, that's tough. Let he got a little go. peanut head. Oh my God, it's so little. Let it grow back, man. Yeah. Are you trying to grow back? No, no, first thing first. I'm looking outside, it ain't no sun. My bald head, I got a white nigga head. What the fuck? My, my bald head gotta get some sun. But overall, I feel like I got a different glow about myself now. Like, no, oh, black boy I feel joy. Like my teeth whiter or something. I don't know. Do y'all see that shit? I look, I look exactly that shit. My overall went up to a 99. I want y'all to know it don't matter how y'all, it don't matter how you look at all. It don't matter. It don't matter if you think you ugly and all. It's weird. It don't matter. You can do and be anything you want as long as you facing your shit. Get out of your comfort zone. Y'all been fucking with me for this long, and I have never showed y'all my hairline or none of that shit. It's stuff about me. I had everything I want. Millions of fans. Y'all accepted me for who I was, but I still wasn't good within myself with myself. <coughs> now I feel free. I feel like I left a lot. Of, I, I I left let off a lot of weight. 
And girls never cared about my hair. You know, they don't, they ain't gonna let you fuck regardless. Females don't care how you look these days, man. I go off the energy. It's all about your energy and how you treat yourself. Why you think you got singers like Lizzo? She was like a play cleaner with all the Hall of Fame badges. But she is, she Lizzo. She's. He don't know what to say. But listen, what the fuck? What, I'm to tell what you was your point? Like Kodak Black. Like, look at Lil Baby. I ain't gonna lie. Lil Baby ugly as shit. That nigga ugly like. <laughs> Lil Baby is Lil Baby. It don't matter how he look. He's Lil Baby. Why are you roasting You get what I'm saying? I'm just trying to give people for an example. I got the Kobe. I got a bald head. Do it matter? I'm still the same nigga. Hoodie so in the building. Do he so in the building. I'm about to go outside and get some sun. I just want y'all to start loving yourself. And I want y'all to know. I went through a lot of stuff when I was a kid. I went through a lot of trauma, a lot of pain with my hair. I had a lot of hair loss. I went through a lot of crazy stuff when I was a kid that only my family know about. And little did I know that stuff that I went through was impacting me to this day. I didn't even know. I've been turned into memes and shit. So it's like I accepted wearing do-rags and hats and all this shit all the time. I'm going to start doing videos with my bald head. Simple. <laughs> yourself man take care of yourself be free who cares man it don't matter how you look just be free accept that shit accept your flaws all right y'all i'm out man <laughs> can't take you <it> serious <laughs> i mean good for him um I'm not really familiar with Saluminati. I know, I know of him, of course, but um, I've seen him go through a lot of changes. He lost a lot of weight, he stopped smoking. Um, he got real spiritual. Now he cut his dreads off. I can say one thing about dreads. I've never had dreads, but I knew people who, had, who have had dreads. And especially like my good Judy, my best friend, she actually cut her dreads off because she said it felt like she was, she said it felt like the dreads were like holding on to a lot of negative energy. Um, she was in a really bad relationship. So after she broke up with her boyfriend, she said that the dreads had to go. And after she cut them off, she said she felt a lot of relief and she felt a lot better after she cut them off. She had some really pretty dreads too. I was so mad at her when she did it, but hey, if it's if it's some type of like therapy to cut your dreads off and to let go of like negative energy and if it's like a, a growing thing for you like a growing process then i support you 100 percent. but yeah um this nigga is so funny dog all right y'all that was my reaction to this video if you guys enjoyed my reaction please make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next reaction video bye